guys, welcome to Digital World YouTube channel. My name is Akim Abiodo, and in today's video, I will be showing you how to use count if and count ifs formula in Excel. So we use count if to count based on a certain criteria. So you can use count if if you have a list of um, a, a range of data sets and you want to count a specific item out of it. So you can use count if to do that based on a criteria and you can also use count if based on multiple criteria so i'm going to show you how that works today so the very first thing i have this data set right and in this data set i have the customer id the full name the gender the city and the country so let's start with count if so we want to use count if to count the number of male and female that is the number of appearance for the gender so I'm going to type, um, so this will be the gender, and this will be the number of appearance, number of appearance, I'll just write it like this, so number of appearance, then I'll make it bold, so let me just make it bold, and resize the column, so right here I'll just type in male, male, and um, down here I'll type in female, female so now we are going to make use of count if to count the gender which is we want to count male and we want to count female so i'll say count if so all our formula must start with equals to so i'll say equals to count if count if count if in the range so i have to select the range before putting the criteria so i'll put in this range this is the gender range so I'll put the gender range, comma, then the criteria that I want to count is male. So there are two ways of adding the criteria. You can either type the criteria in double quotation or you select it in the cell. Since we have it out here in the cell. So I'm going to show you the two ways. The very first way is to type it out. So in double quotation, male, then close my double quotation. This will work if you do it like this. You can just press enter. Now you can see it shows us that, okay, this is 69 male. So let's do the same. Let I will just clear it and redo it. So I say equals to count if count if then the range is still the gender, right? And I will I'll just select the criteria here because I already have it here. I'll just select it and close the bracket and press enter. Now I have 69. So with this I can copy it down because I have the cell selected. So with Excel, you have to set up the syntax, right? So once you set up the layout, then Excel can copy it down for you. All you just have to do is just do one and Excel will do the others. So for this, I already have this cell H6. Um, so all I just have to do is copy down and it's going to do the female gender for me. So that is for count if. Count if deals with only one criteria. But if you are going into count if, that is when we have multiple criteria. So um, let's say I want to count the gender for USA alone. So I can just copy this, I'll paste this down, and um, the number of appearance for USA um, appearance, USA appearance. So uh, I want to count for just USA alone. So I can say, now I'm not dealing with one criteria. Now they have to be male, with this one, it has to be male, and they have to come from USA. So that is dealing with multiple criteria. So count if cannot do this. We have to make use of count ifs. So I'm just going to say equals to count ifs. Count ifs. So with count ifs, I can select multiple range and multiple criteria. So I'll, I can start with any of this range. So I'll start with gender first. Right? After selecting the column for the gender, which is my criteria range, I can put my criteria there, which is the male for that gender column. Then the criteria range too, I'll select the country and I need just USA. So in double quotation, I will just type USA, then close my quotation. I can now close my brackets and press enter. So this will show up, uh, this will perform, this will help me to get the total number of USA male. Then I can just copy this down and I have USA female. So now out of all this total of 69 male that I have, 15 are from USA, 
and out of this 82 female that I have, 16 are from USA. So that is how to work with count if and count ifs in Excel. Can you hit the subscribe button and turn up the bell notification icon to get notified whenever we drop awesome videos like this. And thank you. I'll see you in the next video.